Hi everybody, this is Mumbles, and today we are playing Moon Glow Bay. I started playing this game without recording, because I thought that it would need some time to, like, establish itself, but from the get-go it has a story, so I actually wanted to start a new game to kind of show it off to you guys. So let's get started. This is a fishing game where you get to be a little fisherman. If you notice, all of these characters are old. <laughs> That's the first thing you need to think about. I like this one. That's probably how I'm going to look when I'm old. You can pick your pronouns, which is very cool. Mumbles. Actually, let's give her a real name. This is my go-to video game name, Moxie. And then... This is when I kind of had a feeling something was up. You get to pick a a partner. So let's pick him. And I was sort of like, what's happening here? And I just love the idea that you can customize who you are, but also who you choose to be. Um, so let's get started. I love the colors of this. It reminds me a lot of my grandpa, actually. Like, I'm old. <laughs> so my grandpa had a lot of, like, stuff from the 70s. So a lot of this, like, color scheme was what he would wear. Um, so it's kind of nostalgic for me. <laughs> the curse. Fisher is his last name because we're fishers. Right, so you can actually pet the dog, look. Yay, that's exciting. All right, let's fish. Okay. So let's go, great. Okay, so basic, you know, fishing mechanisms here. Waiting for it. Just chilling, waiting for that fish, you know? Almost here. Oh! D O. So as it turns, you have to kind of just pull it in, which is a interesting fishing mechanic. It's like most of the actual fishing games, like the ones that are like big bass fishing, and you like go into a lake and you put the fish in the line, and then you get to, like, see the bottom of the lake and stuff. <laughs> Do you guys ever play the Ocarina of Time fishing game? That was my favorite. <laughs> I would just go. I wouldn't do anything except for just go to the little fishing pond. <laughs> All right, come on. I wonder, like, how much arm strength it takes to actually be a fisher person. Do you fish? If you do, how much arm strength do you need, actually? you I guess if you go, like, swordfish fishing, you get one of those, uh, uh, like, chairs. How do the chairs work? I really don't know. I'm really excited to cook up some recipes. Oh, I forgot to mention, once we're once we're more settled into the game, but I had Nick make me a mocktail that is blue to go with this game, and I'm very excited for it. But first, we should get through this little cutscene. <laughs> oh no, the monster. I'm on the land, and yet... This whale is going to torment me. Huh? Oh, close one. Woof. Oh. That's the one thing about doing like any games is you don't know. The game could just crash. <laughs> and then you just have to do it all over again and hope for the best. Oh. 
This is your dream. What's your dream? I don't know. <laughs> to hang with you. <laughs> That's cool. So what I love about this game is that it's about old people. These people have been together for 40 years. I don't, I've never played a like Stardew Valley life sim game where you are old. And I think that is so cool. Okay, so this is when I knew that I needed to play this for you guys. Um, it looks like her partner died. Like, he didn't make it past the first cutscene. So now you're just a, a sad old lady with your sweet doggo. What I love about this is... Like, if you look at her house, it's pretty messy. She hasn't tried in a bit. And to be fair, I wouldn't either. <laughs> and then you have a kid already. Like, this is so smart. This is so interesting to me. Takeout boxes. stall. You gotta run a food stall in this game. That rocks. Huh. Alright, let's uh, clean up a little bit. Oh, man. Just cleaning up your house. Uh, I've just never, I don't, I've never played a game like this that wants to have the main character be older and is about, I mean, there's plenty of games about depression, I guess, but I don't know. This feels different. This feels very um, mundane, but I mean that in a good way. Like the mundane of cleaning up your home because you're sad, you know? Like, that's really interesting to me. Okay, I think I got all... Oh, no, I got those over here. And I'm curious because this game got some mixed reviews. Uh, I don't really know why, but it did. And I wonder if part of it is the graphics. I think the graphics take a little bit of time to get used to because um, it's very Minecrafty. but the game itself reminds me more of Pokemon than anything else. Your fishing rod, your kitchen, place to sell food. Okay. Let's fish. And the other thing is that, like, when you're sad, you really have to just do mundane tasks and you have to 
get into habits and rituals in order to like feel better, at least for me anyway. Oh, weird. Okay, hold on a second. Before I fish, oh, I'm fishing already. Let me bring my line in. <laughs> Can I bring my line in please? Oh, here we go. I don't get this. All right. I'm going to bring my line in so I can share my little drinky drink with you. Well, okay. So today I'm drinking this little blue concoction that Nick made for me. Again, William Sonoma. Again, Ritual. Am I looking for a sponsorship for Ritual? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if they're interested or not. But that would be cool. Um, it's two ounces of the blue stuff, the blueberry pomegranate mixer, and then one ounce of the ritual whiskey. And it tastes really good. It tastes really good. It's quite good. It's, I like the quote unquote skinny stuff just because it has less sugar <laughs> and it's less sweet. So it kind of just doesn't cause as much of a headache for me. All right, I don't fucking understand this at all. Oh. I don't understand this at all, dude. Okay. Why would they make it so easy in the tutorial and then make this bad? Hold on a second. <laughs> All right, let me see. Let me see what I'm doing wrong. Is she gonna tell me what I'm doing wrong here? Let me have this fish. Let me have it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> my, my husband's upset. Because I'm yelling at this fucking fish. <laughs> I'm trying a different way. I'm finessing it. I finessed it! Okay, I figured it out. You have to finesse it. You can't just hold down on the direction. You have to just tap it. Okay. Fucking fishing simulators. They're all like this. Every fishing minigame is like, I've got to learn how to do fishing. And it takes you like 20 fucking minutes and then you're good at it. Ah, oh, okay. Having a mocktail. All right, I feel better. Escape. J. L. Escape. Get me out of here. There we go. The escape button for that was delete, just in case anyone was wondering. What's I mean? Okay. Okay. Huh. <sighs> Goodness. Let's see if I got any better at this.
There we go. See? I got it. I figured it out. You just gotta do like long strokes <laughs> is the key to this. We figured it out. <laughs> it's lung strokes. <laughs> Abby Braun. Abby Braun. Abby Braun. I like the face drawings in this. Oh god. Sorry for all the yelling. I was gonna lose my mind if I couldn't figure out how to catch a fish. It's like, if you can't figure out how to do the game mechanic, you can't play this game. Sorry. <laughs> Your character's just gonna be depressed the rest of their lives because they can't catch a fish. Uh -huh. Let's make a meal. Okay. A little wash. <laughs> A washing mini game? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> okay. Chop. Got it. Got it. Cool. Boil. Ah. Oh, this is hard. Oh, this is really hard. That's the hardest one. Okay, let's try again. Making this poor lady's life the worst. I have destroyed this fool. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. <laughs> this is why. My guess is this is the reason why this game has kind of mixed reviews. Because <laughs> of the mini games. <laughs> They're like WarioWare. All right, wash. Okay, chop. I wonder if this game is better with a controller. My guess is probably easier with controller, which is something that's been happening to me lately. Oh, so close. 
I don't know what I did wrong with that, but hey, it's better than the last one. <laughs> oh my god, dude. All right. Let's cook one more. I can do this. I'm gonna, if I play this again for streaming, by the way, we do streaming on Thursdays now. Right now we're playing Sable, but if I ever end up playing this game, I'm gonna play it with controller because it's kind of weird on mouse and keyboard. Yeah, did a chop. All right, here comes my mortal enemy. Oh, I did okay. Yeah, doing better at this. I don't know how to do better on that. Okay, we did good. Escape. Let's go put our food out for people. Hi, doggy. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, excuse me. Oh, it's just like uh, when you have your little selling thing. Oh, I think maybe my husband was killed by that whale, is what I'm guessing. Cool. Well, I think that's enough for now. You know? <laughs> I got so mad at this uh, fishing game, it alerted my husband. So, <sighs> you know. Either that or he's being eaten by a giant whale as we speak. I don't know. But... It's kind of a cute game once you get the hang of it. And I think once you start selling stuff, you know, it starts making the little light in your brain go off. It's like, I did a thing. I got the shiny. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed and I'm going to go wander around.